Hello, my wonderful people, my viewers and subscribers. Hey, I'm on the Abu Nudanakrika. It don't happen again, according to my people. I say, when you baranka, also unguere ya barayo ogwo. Oh, let me speak it to the understanding of my people who don't hear English as well. That who fetch anti-fested firewood, invited lizard for a dinner, according to English in Tapiaren. It don't happen again, oh. I'm not gonna hear this headline before I tell on what I want to tell my people. Human Rights Writers Association of Nigeria and also they cover the Black Biafra and as well. Task South East Governors on the prescribing IPOB. This one na people where they I mean they are like a form of human rights. And uh, this thing where they, they come out now, come they tell us now. They are something where our South Eastern governors, all those influence that call themselves South Eastern governors, they would have Counter this thing, you know, imagine them, they cannot have been countering this thing, and these people now have come out now in full force and said, if the so called uh, uh, South Eastern governors they cannot do anything about it, that they will not take it again. That even the international community condemn it that calling IPOP proscribed is never welcomed. So, make I tell on, I say, this one, oh, yeah, this one, no, be say, now Simon never talk or Martin Nam, they cannot talk. This one and another Obonga group, we don't come out to say whether they like it or not. Also, Biafra and IPOB must stand, and nobody dare prescribe, call them a proscribed uh, 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 organization again. And they try to know that any organization that does this, they will sue them to ICC court, that is International Criminal Court. So, make on and no say. Biafra and IPOV have come to stay, and I'm very, very happy about it. And I don't, I don't know about you, wherever you are, please, as you're listening to Sarah Mozia, make Ozia Rute Oyuku Nonyan Taka, Mokeke Mokafo. Everybody needs to hear about this. That in a group have come out and stand and said, anyone that got to do with it or that proscribed IPOV again is going to hear from them. Now, so the thing take to come. So, any hand that will share this message, my declaration upon your head is that before the end of this month we are into, this uh, August, you will receive a, a tremendous turnaround of blessing in good faith. Receive it and let me hear a mighty amen at the comment section. This one, uh, I don't hear to bash anybody. In fact, from now onwards, I'm not going to bash anybody again. But if you do anyhow, you see anyhow. And if you do anyhow, you collect what they call Woto Woto. You get the point now. So, as you are listening, like, share, and also comment. My good people of Biafra, hear the news in details. A group announces cancellation of seat at home. Human Rights Writers Association of Nigeria yesterday all the governors of the Southeast to immediately the prescribed the indigenous people of Biafra Airport saying it is the fattest past part to restoration of peace in the region and the shortest way to enable constructive and law-based dialogues. The group in a statement by its national coordinator, Wayne Imam Omubiko, recalled that the Southeast Governors Forum rose from its meeting on September 15 of 2017, make on a year where this starts, proscribing IPOP in the entire region. Now, Southeastern governors, now they proscribe IPOP. That is why the federal government, under the leadership of uh, uh, what do they call it, under the leadership of uh, that uh, Fulani president of, of Nigeria, where he named be Muhammad Buhari, before he picked it up from there and proscribed IPOP. But before then, here in my Isha in Aka, it started from the southeastern governors. Now they gathered together and proscribed Apop. Starting from the, the initiator of uh, Ibubago, which is uh, Hope Who's a Danger, and that uh, local devil, Mahe, Woka Bakeleke. Now they join hand and do this to us. Human Rights Association of Nigeria, which is uh, Huriwa, noted that the former governor of Ebony State and chairman of the Southeast Governors Forum at the time, David Mahe, had told journalists in the office that Nam De Kano was gradually losing control of the situation, which informed the call on governors in the region to wade in to prevent further bloodshed. The group quoted, Umayi are saying 
that the prosecution had achieved the desired result. If we are, have you seen it? Not the Fulani, so sometimes now we'll be calling a uh, Fulani Kabas like this, like that. Our people are the one being controlled by the Fulani at the uh, Asoroko, and they are doing their bidding. That is the problem we are having, uh, and which we have to stop it. According to Omu Biko, the former governor had noted that IPOB had lost its original idol by causing unnecessary tension and killings in the southeast which he said has affected investment drive in the region, according to uh, Dave Omahe of them. The rise group of others stated that, based on the Omahe's claim, the military did not attack IPOP members as claimed by Kano, suggesting that it was IPOP members who threw bottles and stones at the military officers. Huriwa, which faulted the decision of the governors to proscribe IPOP, resulting in military actions against members of the group, including the arrest and detention of the IPOB leader, has again asked the newly elected governors of the region to undo the collective harm they have unleashed on the region by the prescribing IPOB to de-escalate violence in the region. It is also asked the governors to prevail on President Bolame Tunumbu to release Maze Namde Kano. The group, however, condemned the continuous enforcement of sit-at-home order by Simon Epa, saying the action has engendered the widespread killings of Ibo and Krombo, the region's economy. Meanwhile, IPOB yesterday began the distribution of flyers uh, and posters across the southeast to notify residents of cancellation of the said sit-at-home exercise in the region. I post post person where be Ima powerful and the other DOS members disclosed this in a statement titled Monday Weekly Sit at Home An Ugly Phase of a Bygone History That Must Never Be Repeated as Echoed by Maze Namdekano. Powerful explained that the exercise was aimed at conveying Kano's pronouncement, cancelling the practice or whatsoever. In that message, the group said any person or persons talking about a non existence at home in the region is an enemy of the people and shall be dealt with accordingly. This one is part of the news. Oh, in the other hand, we have another one where we say again, oh, emo residency, they don't still comply with the death said they sit at home order where they happen in the southeastern part of the country. Make on a see how everywhere, everywhere was deserted. You say this one too much. You. In fact, this matter, you don't pass. Be careful. Many Imo state residents across the 27 councils uh, on uh, Thursday, sorry to say, complied with the seat at home order issued by Simon Epa, led factions of indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, ignoring the economic empowerment option by the incarcerated leader of the of the group nam the kano in a way the state capital many business premises were closed including banks markets and other food outlets ignoring the state government directive for businesses to open or risk being sealed can you seal the business you never open the answer is the he there were a handful of vehicles on the roads even as security operatives on joint operations we are patrolling the city it was the same story in other parts of the state. Some shop owners who opened merely provided skeletal sales and services hiding and selling to their customers. The Guardian observed that over the streets, such as Wetheran, Douglas, Okiwe, Ebu, Mbise, Nekede, Banke, uh, including adjoining roads in Aladema, Ikedebu, Layout, among others, we all are deserted. Hey. That's why this, this problem no definition. Also, Kano had uh, through his special uh, lawyer, a lawyer Jimako, directed an end to sit at home, starting economic losses by the Southeast people. But Ekpa, who is based in Finland, objected to the directives, referring to it as fake. A trader on Wetra Road, popularly known as uh, Tabo, said the only way to end the sit at home is for the president. Bolambe Trumbu to issue a directive freeing Kano from detention. He said, they know what to do. Let Trumbu free Kano. That is the only way or the only thing 
that we make us believe the end to sit at home on Mondays when we see him. He would say it and who would believe him. On a yaram, this one oh, na people, where they for all over there, and then they bring this message. Can they give a uh, full and control government of for Nigeria and uh, all that parasitas where they for the matter? Can they talk say, even if they like, oh, may they cancel it at home, may they say everybody must come out, can't do business. Say the hero, they know go they do their business. Despite the fact, say government say if you know open your shop, say they go see them, they don't care. Even as it happened in the Enugu state, they don't carry John body, can't tell your guy uh, back, say this your shop where you don't close, you must open it. <laughs> Whether by fire by force. Anyway, by wonderful people. That this message I can't carry give on our on our own. Remember know how they take you Make it most say this message go viral. And I tell you the simple truth. Before I start this news, I said any hand that type amen and also share this message must surely the reward will receive the reward abundantly in any way in many ways so as you they watch make it a share as you they share remember that you need to subscribe as you are subscribing then hit that like button without that my brother how can this ministry move forward remember that you also need to comment at the comment section let me know what you think concerning this news because me okute and the, the, your only uh, what they call it your only media man with a difference uh, where they flow anyhow where they give you news can they join them with uh other uh, uh, uh comedy my brother now here yeah, yeah. we'll take back our car and be like saying i go with the one go so they're gonna wait for another heavy and other ones where go come your way remember that without you there will be no okute daily talk that is why you need to subscribe to my channel like share and also comment have a nice day May the good Lord bless you as you share, as you like, and as you comment. Through Christ, our Savior. <laughs> Can I hear a louder amen? See you all, my people. Until I come your way again, I still remain. Okute, daily talk. Bye for now. Kemesiano.